Do you know what is the state of Indonesia today while we eating halwa? Do you know what happened three years ago in Indonesia to the Indonesian rupiah? Hmm? The IMF had just issued a clean bill of health to Indonesia, an economy which is strong, healthy. Hmm? Indonesia is a major oil producing country. Indonesia has land which is very fertile. Hmm? Indonesia has a big population, energetic population. Indonesia is a, has an abundance of mineral resources. There's no reason why Indonesia should be poor. And the IMF says that Indonesia has a very healthy economy. Suddenly, suddenly, the Indonesian rupiah is attacked by the blood-sucking predatory elite in the banking centers around the world. And the Indonesian rupiah falls. It is trading at about 8,000. And within a period of one day, one week, it, it becomes 20,000 rupiah to one US dollar. In the process of bringing down the Indonesian money, they were able to rip off Indonesia of probably more than half of its wealth. Half of Indonesia is automatically, instantaneously reduced to below the poverty line. Half of Indonesia. And guess what is the poverty line? $29 a month. <laughs> $29 a month. Because we accepted paper as money. The reason why they attacked Indonesia is because the Indonesian loves Islam. He's not passive in his Islam. He has an activism inside of him. He's prepared to fight. He's prepared to die. That's the Indonesian. So you have to demonize them. Use the media to demonize them. Look, make them look bad. And then secondly, you've got to cut their throat from inside, reduce them to destitution and poverty, groveling poverty, and then you imprison them in slavery. The same thing is happening with Turkey. The same thing. Do you know?